hello friends in previous video i will i will show you how to connect camera with our application and display camera live view in our application now i will show you in this video how to capture the image from the camera and save in our system so first let's declare and define some required function and create a object first declare object of view camera image captured class and camera image also take one counter variable to count every image also add one view image object to save camera image in our in this object image from camera okay now add one function to process the captured image image capture. pass one with parameter first one is request id and second one is const view image img okay now define the function and assign the memory of camera image object new q camera image capture just pass your camera object here and call the data function now set capture destination capture to file okay now connect this object with our first our slot image capture this our main window slot image capture okay now let's write the code in our image capture function first parameter is not using our functionality so just call q on use function to avoid the warning Okay, now let's save image from to save UI call our camera view control uh, keep aspect ratio and QP no pass okay now just simply create the part to save the image use string image path application yes. I am saving this image where my application build just simply add the counter in our image increment the counter before the save dot bmp now save this image in our system qpix map from image just pass your object and call save function and give the path now reset button to capture the image 
get third image. Assign the object name. Just simply call function capture. Okay. This function automatically called when image was captured successfully and it saved one specific part. Okay, now let's run the application. Camera is connected successfully and you can see camera view. Now click on capture image. You can see image is saved. Now I click again. The second image was saved. Click again. Third image was saved. 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. You can see all 10 images are saved successfully now i put one more object in front of camera and then click on capture so you can you can see camera is capturing the image successfully i hope you will understand this code and functionality Just simply let me explain some, some few steps. First, create a object of Q camera, Q camera image capture class. Create a one function to save and process the image. And just simply get the data from the camera and save, save in your object and save in specific part. And capture the image, you just have to call the capture function of that object. So, camera will automatically capture the image, and this slot is automatically called. Thank you guys for watching the video, and please drop your comment if you have any question. And please like the video and subscribe my YouTube channel. Thank you.